Alright guys, we made it to Amsterdam, so we're about to spend uh, four days here. Just waiting. <laughs> just waiting for Abdi, the Uber driver. Should be here any minute now. He is a bit late though, which is a bit annoying. Won't get a tip for that, eh? Silly Abdi. Anyway, so we can't head to the Airbnb right away, so we're just gonna head to a uh, breakfast club, an um, actual coffee shop, not, not, the, uh, not the illegal type here. It's not illegal. What? A person who thinks all the time has nothing to think about except thoughts. So, he loses touch with reality and lives in a world of illusions. By thoughts I mean specifically chatter in the skull, perpetual and compulsive repetition of words, of reckoning and calculating. I'm not saying that thinking is bad. Like everything else is useful in moderation. A good servant, but a bad master. And all so-called civilized peoples have increasingly become crazy and self-destructive because through excessive thinking they have lost touch with reality. That's to say, we can choose science with the real world.
most of us would have rather money than tangible wealth. And a great occasion is somehow spoiled for us unless photographed. And to read about it the next day in the newspaper is oddly more fun for us buckets. than the original event. <laughs> This is a disaster. For as a result of confusing the real world of nature with mere science, we are destroying nature. We are so tied up in our minds that we've lost our senses. Time to wake up. What is reality? Obviously, no one can say because it isn't words. It isn't material, that's just an idea. Reality is...